Ever since the invention of the second gas engine, as it takes two to race, the boys have been competing. And it really doesn't matter what they're racing, it's about the competition. There's likely no better event to define that than the Knox Mountain Hill Climb. Located in Kelowna, BC, the Knox Mountain Hill Climb is the longest running paved hill climb in the world. Every spring, drivers show up with all sorts of horse-powered rides and take over this road through the park to find out who is the fastest. The road, while paved, is narrow with off-camber corners and seriously steep grades. Great for a nice Sunday drive, but hardly a racetrack. The only way to try and tame this run is to keep on coming back. They keep coming back and they uh, just pick away at you know every corner a little differently or not every not differently but just you know trying to get the run down smoother and uh, you know a little more power in the car maybe different tires you know and it's, they kind of look forward to coming back it's only once a year so they got all year to prepare. This is my first time at Knox Mountain never even been to the Okanagan before so uh, it's quite a thrill yesterday was a little bit weird though I came here to the land of the sunshine and it poured rain all over us so um, it's a hard mountain, hard to learn. Very technical course? Well, it's very technical and in road racing, which is what I'm used to, lap after lap, your 52-year-old old brain gets imprinted with what comes next, what comes next, what comes next. You run a hill climb, every shot you go up, it's a brand new thing and you only get two runs yesterday. It's hard to learn. You'd have to come back here five, six, seven, eight years to really learn it and go fast, really. But it's fun. It's a fast, it's a very fast uh, track. Uh, lots of high speeds and uh, maybe the railings are there are not too many railings so I'm scared but I'm, I'm gonna go. New guy coming up, what should you look out for on the hill? Turn five. Yeah, <laughs> turn five is uh, it's a fun corner but it yeah it can do some harm but it, it's good you know that's the only thing. The hill's fun, it's, it's well kept, it's well maintained. And... You gonna come back for another 15 years? Oh yeah, as long as uh, the wife will let me. <laughs> If you make a mistake, it's, you're really going to pay the price. That's at the speeds we're going. The huge mix of vehicles that enter keep the crowds entertained and the action interesting. Of particular note, these big rigs pull hard to make the grade and get the gears shifted up the run. And as we paid witness, some do it better than others. John Hafner, who's been coming here for over 30 years and holds the course record, has some good advice for drivers. I would tell them just to, uh, to really learn the hill, walk the hill, look at the corners, pick your braking markers, and be careful. Uh, first timers have a habit of crashing on hill, uh, including myself. I crashed the first year I came in 1971. Line is important uh, on a racetrack. In hill climbing, I, I have a little different philosophy. Uh, I like to take a line uh, going into the corner, but uh, you don't get very many chances at the hill, so I, I tend to, uh, to be a little conservative and hang to the inside a little more than you would in a racing corner, just for safety. It gives you a little bit of slide out room. Whether you have an old beater, an open-wheeled racer, or an 18-wheeler, if reaching the top in the fastest time possible is what you crave, then add the Knox Mountain Hill Climb to your May calendar.